My name is Thomas Peshak and I'm a photographer for National Geographic magazine. And I mainly do underwater marine wildlife stories. Um, anything to do with the ocean and islands, that's sort of my specialty. I used to be a marine biologist and then about probably 15 years ago I made that transition from scientist to photojournalist. Probably snorkeled first at age like six to eight and it was just one of those instant love affairs. I mean the ocean just kind of, it was a place I got underwater had a look around with a mosque and a snorkel and it was just instant, an instant connection. It was an environment that kind of just really, you know, really, I felt like I belonged there. And, and then I started diving at age 12 and, and I've probably been in the ocean ever since. I knew I wanted to be a marine biologist or be involved in, in the ocean in some way, probably from age 10. I document some of the most last, pristine, intact, amazing ocean systems in the world. You know, you know very remote atolls in Indian Ocean, places like Aldabra and Seychelles. The, the, you know, the cold oceans off the Canadian-Alaskan border. I mean, incredibly rich of life. I want my images to make a difference and I want to leave a legacy where my images actually end up with the ocean being you know, in better shape than they are right now. And you have to have that deep underlying passion for the ocean. You have to want this more than anything else because there's easier ways to make a living than this. You, know, you have to be one million billion percent obsessed in doing this. Begin in your backyard. Begin working on animals and stories that are local. If you have a great story and you're passionate about a little crab in a marina or a little seal, whatever it might be. If you're passionate, people will embrace that story.